Hi Sagittarius, welcome to your weekly forecast. Now this is for March 16th until 23rd. Let's take a look. Mm. Well, you are eyeing on a water sign and it seems like you're just trying to find the strength or you're just trying to find the right opportunity or perfect time to confess your feelings about this person or for the two of you to be together. There is a love triangle that's going to be, uh, well, that is already happening, okay? And there will also be some changes into your home environment, especially if you're with an earth sign. Earth sign or water sign. Now, you've been thinking about this water sign for like, you know, for like for the past few weeks or past few months. And somehow you're, you're wondering whatever happened to this person since the short communications have ceased. Now, there will also be some um, uh, changes in your home environment. I feel like an earth sign will be moving out of your house. Or an earth sign will be making some changes into your home environment. But whatever it is, it is for the better and it is for, you know, for positive note. Now, somebody from the past that you're kind of thinking about or someone who's a fire sign, a younger fire sign that will be coming your way. This is somebody that you used to play around with. And now this person wants you back again for another game or for another play. If you're already in a committed relationship, stay away from the temptation. Otherwise, you're... You will have a hard time, um, you know, changing the consequences of this. There has been a lot of things that's been going on in your domestic life right now or in your relationship that you feel like, you know, you're the only one who can put a solution to this or you're the only one who can cut off whatever that's been like, you know, invading in your um, uh, private life or in your privacy. So... Especially if there is a fire sign that you've been entertaining lately, and this is somebody from your past. Now, this person have already abandoned you or already moved away from you, but you are the one who keeps in contacting and reaching out just because that you're so afraid that your present situation right now or your present relationship won't get better and there is a chance of a breakage. Now, if you are the one who keeps on thinking about that, then, you know, you know the law of attraction, it will definitely happen if that is what you really fear. Whereas I feel like the issues that you've been um, having as a problem is the communications and the understanding, open-mindedness, and honesty, transparency, okay? And I also feel like there's too much stubbornness that's been happening in this uh, relationship since that they're, you know, the, the, well, your boat is no longer um, even, okay, or even. Um, you need to find a way in how to save your, your foundation. Otherwise, someone will be invading it, you know, in, within the next few weeks. I feel like your partner is being seduced by another fire sign who is older than you, but younger than your spouse. Okay. So be very careful about the choices that you will be making. As I've said, that if you're on already with somebody for a long period of time, then there will be a balance of power and balance of karma. Whatever you do, the other person will be reflecting it and doing it as well for you to see how it is to be in their shoes and for them to see how it is to be in your place as well. Now, there is a huge... Um, well, there's still a huge solution, Okay. And uh, there's still a way for the two of you to save whatever that's left before it. everything else will definitely crumble down into pieces. Or tiny bits of pieces. And I, I feel like it's, uh, you know, it's not yet too late. Uh, somehow, that there is also a promise from the fire sign that you're counting on and that you are holding on but unfortunately this person is only playing around with your mind so that they can get whatever they want from you okay either it's a physical or like an emotional pursuit but this person doesn't really mean well and they don't have any clean intention towards you but to mess around whatever that you already have right now because they are pretty much miserable and unhappy in their current situation now 
if both of you are thinking about moving into two separate houses or if you're if, or if you, both of you are splitting your house into two parts then this is where the problem will start really you know sinking in and wrapping into your harmony I feel like you are the one who already shut down the communications and the other person just cared too much in the past but now they've they've already grown out of it and they've already grown tired of being patient and trying to work things out or work out the relationship and they are already thinking of moving away without you knowing they're already planning things behind you which is late, uh, later on you will be surprised that they were you know that you know how could they plan this right behind you while you thought that you're doing well and that you know well the two of you are still together but unfortunately there are some people who's just you know who doesn't really want to talk anymore especially if they don't feel like they be they're being heard or they're being given the freedom to talk and to express themselves you shut down the relationship and you shut yourself out from this you know entire situation that's why your partner just follow the same pattern and now that you're fully aware of what you have done and what you have caused the relationship um now you're starting to to regret okay those things and those actions that you have done and i feel like you know there are some things that your partner hasn't really been um disclosing to you which is more likely it has something to do with bank insurance property asset management or stuff like that okay so they are the one i feel like they're the one who's also earning more than you that's why they're um, securing their perimeter and they're also securing their own security. All right. At this point, you know, in the, this week, it's time for you. The effort should come from you because since that you are the one who shut down and since that you are the one who cut off the communications in the past, you are the only one who can also open it up. Okay, it's not yet too late for you to save your foundation while you still have time. But if you're going to wait out for six more weeks, that there will be more damages, you know, that will happen and that will incur. Anyway, that's it for you for this week, Sagittarius. And if you want to talk to me live on the phone or live in the calls, just go and visit me at my website at sophieangel.net. Blessings to you.